Welcome aspirants, you're watching Decode IES and in this video, we'll decode the environment and ecology section from June 2025 current affairs crisp, insightful, and upsy ready. Let's begin. The key highlight this month was India's launch of the National Climate Resilience Mission 2025. The mission aims to integrate climate adaptation into development planning at state and district levels. It focuses on building early warning systems, protecting water resources and promoting green agriculture practices. This approach moves India from reactive disaster management to proactive climate resilience, a major shift in policy vision. Next the Union Cabinet approved the National Green Hydrogen Policy Phase 2, expanding incentives for electrolyzer manufacturing and export-linked production. The policy targets 10 million tonnes of annual green hydrogen output by 2035, positioning India as a clean energy leader. It will also create over 5 lakh new green jobs and attract global investment in the renewable sector. Another major update came from the UN Environment Assembly, where India presented its global bioeconomy framework, promoting sustainable resource use, bioplastics and organic alternatives to chemical fertilizers. This framework strengthens India's soft power in international climate negotiations. Meanwhile the Ministry of Environment released the State of Forest Report 2025, showing a 0.6% rise in total forest cover, with gains in the Western Ghats and Northeast. However it also warned of biodiversity stress in semi-arid zones due to encroachment and mining activities. India also toasted the International Mangrove Alliance meet in Chennai where 15 countries pledged support for restoring 50,000 hectares of mangroves by 2030. The initiative complements India's Mishti program the Mangrove Initiative for Shoreline Habitats and Tangible Incomes. Now, let's move to news and shorts. The National Clean Air Program NCAP, reported a 28% reduction in PM2.5 levels in 18 major cities. The Central Pollution Control Board launched a unified emissions trading platform industries. The Arctic Science Expedition 2025 saw Indian scientists studying polar ice melt and its effect on monsoon variability. The Niti Aayog announced a green growth dashboard to track carbon-neutral policies across states. And the Delhi Urban Forest Initiative added 100 new mini-forests for carbon absorption and biodiversity revival. Another positive milestone India crossed 200 gigawatts of renewable energy capacity, reinforcing its position as the world's third-largest green energy producer. To summarize June 2025 reflected India's strong commitment to climate leadership, biodiversity conservation, and renewable innovation steering the nation toward a sustainable future. This is Decode IES helping you decode the environment and ecology of a changing India.